And we start with breaking news tonight. The Gravit man facing charges for his involvement in the January 6th storming of the U.S. Capitol testifies in trial. Yeah, Richard Barnett facing several charges, including theft of government property. Now, 439's Phil Reed's been following this case. He talked to our Hearst correspondent who was in the courtroom. And Phil, we know the defense asked Barnett about his alter ego. Yeah, Allison, that's what Dominique Johnson said. She says the defense asked Barnett who Big O' Barnett is. So Barnett describes Big O, that's his different persona as someone who's more into politics and is more outspoken, while he says Richard is a father, community member, and a husband. Barnett is known for this infamous photo that you see right here with his feet on a desk inside former House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's office during the insurrection. So on the stand today, Barnett says he regrets going to the Capitol on January 6th because of the heartache that has caused his family. He says his main goal when he got inside the Capitol was to find a bathroom and that he didn't realize that he was inside Pelosi's office. Barnett also says that he regrets calling her names. And today his family talked to us outside of the courtroom about the death threats that they have been receiving. That's pretty scary when you have that happening. Um, people, you know, sometimes tend to do those things when not knowing the whole picture. You know, they get one skewed view and and without, you know, uh, real provocation, they just jump into the middle of things and threaten people. All right, let's turn back to today's testimony. Barnett says he loves the Constitution and on the witness stand today said, quote, I just feel like our Constitution has been getting trampled. And Barnett also says that it's his constitutional right to protest and that he went to D.C. because he believed that the election was stolen. And I'll have a full recap of Barnett's testimony and more reaction from family tonight on the 4029 News at 9 and 10. Live in the newsroom, Phil Reed of 4029 News.